DJI Mini 3 Pro, DJI Fly Firmware Update. Got that coming up next. Bill the Drone Reviewer here. If you like the content of this video or anything on my channel, make sure you hit the subscribe button and ring the notification bell so you don't miss any future content. With that, let's begin. DJI recently had an update to the DJI Fly app. It was mainly to include the DJI Mini 2 SE, but it also stated that there were improvements to the DJI Mini 3 as well. So without any further ado, let's take a look at the test flight. Okay, recently the DJI Fly app was updated and the main purpose for the update was to add the DJI Mini 2 SE, but it also had said some uh, imp bug improvements. So we're gonna go ahead and take up the Mini 3 Pro and see how things are. Uh, looks like we got 24 satellites and everything's good to go. So let's take off. Okay. Looks like we're ready to rock and roll here. So let's, let's take it up to about 100 feet here. bit past 100 feet so let's go ahead and um, I have it on picture mode okay we changed the portrait didn't want to do that um, there we go we're gonna go ahead to video and we're at 4k 30 that's what uh that's what I'm looking for okay we are underway let's take a look and check things out see how things are Finally, a great day to fly. Uh, last weekend, we had 49, 50 mile an hour wind gusts, and it was just absolutely impossible to fly. Come up to the storage area over there. Take it out to about 1,200 feet. And we're there. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and stop. Let's go ahead and turn around here. Go ahead and adjust the pitch here a little bit. There we go. really like the DJI RC. It's, 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 I can't say enough good things about it. They've done, DJI has done a fantastic job with this. Especially, it is fairly bright today, and I can see this without any issues at all. Hundred and twelve feet. Everything's looking real good. Heading towards three oh one. It's a joy to be able to get out and fly. Not only this is my first time since I had COVID, since I've been out flying, and I'm actually feeling about as close to normal as possible, and I'm very thankful to the Lord for that. I'll tell you that right now. Coming up on 301 here. Okay, we're going to go ahead and stop. Let's go ahead and turn around. And that's because I'm not facing the right direction, okay? That is definitely my problem as far as getting that warning message was concerned.
And we're going to head up and I'm going to take a look at the um, I'm going to take a look at the entrance to the development and I kind of want to focus on the uh, our sign with the waterfall. I want to see um, make sure the focus is, is good with the Mini 3 Pro here. And we're coming up on that now. We're going to stop. I'm going to descend just a little bit here. Okay, that's good. I'm going to adjust this. Take it down. Just a gimbal here a little bit. Let's take it down a little more. Now it goes down. I don't think that's good. Let's take a look and see here. And we're going to get a little lower here. So we're going to take a look and see how this is. about 60 feet here it's actually looking very good um, so I'm I'm pretty impressed with how the uh, the focus is on the mini 3 pro right now it look it looks really good so um, let's go ahead and do a return to home here Adjust the gimbal here. Even though it doesn't have precision landing, I'm always curious to see how well this does. And we are right overhead here. And let's take a look and see how we do here. Hi. About a foot off the map but all in all this was a great test after the dji fly firmware update question of the day what did you think of the dji mini 3 pro after the dji fly update let me know in the comments section below thanks so much for watching and remember it's a great day to fly